not a tough out today. Excuse me, not an easy out. The pop of gunfire can be heard on the live stream of Sunday's video game tournament in Jacksonville, Florida. Moments later, the screams of players running for their lives. Jacksonville firefighters were training nearby and jumped into action. There were people swarming up the road and one guy was lifting up his shirt saying that he was shot and you could tell that he was shot in the chest. It was real people, it was real pain, it was real grief, it was not a video game. Toshiba Sharon was commentating on the tournament when police say a gamer opened fire. Just understand that, that it, there's people like you and I that are dying out here for no reason. CBS affiliate WJAX is reporting that gamers Eli Clayton and Taylor Robertson were killed in the shooting. Suhail Lopez's son was shot three times. He's facing the fact that he might not even be able to use his hand ever again is extreme. The gunman is identified as David Katz, a 24-year-old from Maryland. I think personally I'm one of the better players um, and I like to let my game prove that. This video shows him after he won a Madden tournament in Buffalo last year. Other players say Katz was well known on the competitive gaming circuit, but not outgoing. He's weird all weekend, man. I mean, he had shades on. He just he didn't speak to anybody. We want answers. A small group in Jacksonville protested gun violence, and there are already calls for better security at e-gaming tournaments. Manuel Bajorquez, CBS News, Jacksonville, Florida.